Hi, welcome to Edu Inspire channel. Today we will talk about the Euclid's division lemma. Before we go into the details of Euclid's division algorithm, let's understand what is lemma and what is algorithm. Lemma is a proven statement which is used to prove other statements. An algorithm is a series of well-defined steps which gives a procedure for solving a type of problem. We will go into details as we progress. Now, let's understand what is Euclid's division lemma. It states, for given positive integers a and b, there exist unique integers q and r satisfying a equals to bq plus r where r is equal to or greater than 0 but less than b. Euclid's division algorithm is used to find the HCF of given two positive numbers. Before we go through the examples, let's understand the algorithm. In order to obtain the HCF of two positive integers a and b with a greater than b, follow the given steps. Number 1. Apply Euclid's division lemma to a and b and find whole numbers q and r so that a equals bq plus r where r is equal to or greater than 0 but less than b. Second step, if r equals to 0 then hcf of a and b is b. If r is not equal to 0 then apply the algorithm to b and r. Continue the process till the remainder is 0. The divisor at this stage will be the HCF, that is the highest common factor. Now, let's go through a few examples to understand this algorithm. Example 1. Find the HCF of 740 and 45. Here, 740 is the dividend and 45 is the divisor. Step 1. By applying the algorithm, we get 740 equals 45 into 16 plus 20. As the remainder here is not 0, we proceed to the next step. Step 2 gives us 45 equals 20 into 2 plus 5. Again, as the remainder is not 0, step 3 becomes 20 equals to 5 into 4 plus 0. As the remainder is 0, so the divisor in the last step becomes the HCF, that is 5. The same algorithm can be applied to any two positive integers. Let's take one more example to understand this. This example will help us understand how this algorithm can be used in real life situations. Example 2. A mason has to fit the floor of a hall with square tiles of the largest possible size. The size of the hall is 30 feet by 14 feet. What would be the size of the tiles required? Now, let's try to use the Euclid's division algorithm to solve this problem. As the size of the floor is 30 feet by 14 feet, the required size of the tile will be HCF of 30 and 14. Step 1. By applying the algorithm, we get 30 equals to 14 into 2 plus 2. As the remainder here is not 0, we proceed to the next step. Step 2 gives us 14 equals 2 into 7 plus 0. As the remainder is 0, so the divisor in the last step becomes the HCF, that is 2. Hence, the required size of the tile is 2 feet by 2 feet. Here, we saw how Euclid's division lemma is used and implemented in real life situations. In our next video, we will try to solve the NCERT exercise 
which will help you to understand more about this concept we hope you would have liked this video for many more informative videos please subscribe our channel adu inspire and like and share the videos thank you